Hey guys, standing behind me here is the Vapid Speedo Custom. Now if you own a nightclub you would have seen this vehicle before as it is one of the delivery vehicles available in the nightclub and before the career progress came into the game it was the only way to get one of these vehicles. However now, let's open up my career progress, come all the way to special interests here, weapons expert, by completing the full four tier levels of weapons expert you can unlock the Vapid Speedo Custom as a personal vehicle. Now, when this first came out, this uh, gave us the opportunity to do a lot of god mode glitching with it. And you could take this into your Avenger, and you could apply weapons to it and all the armor plating, just like you could with the uh, delivery one. And yeah, like I said, so a lot of people were abusing the god mode with this. And you can no longer take this vehicle into the Avenger or the MOC, as I had a lot of trouble figuring out this myself. However, I have found a way that you can still add weapons to this, because you can't do it at LS Customs. You need to own an Arena Workshop. That's where I am right now, in the garage of my Arena War, arena Workshop. Uh, however, uh, wrong one, I'm coming to the phone here. What you do need to do, and it took me a little while to figure this one out as well, if you come down to your mechanics here, and I already own it so I can't actually show you. <laughs> you come to this tab here, mechanic, and you're going to have three options. One of them is a weapons expert. You need to purchase the weapons expert in order to be able to put the weapons on this here in your workshop. So let's go in and have a look. So right here, only a moment ago before I started recording this video, this option, weapons, was not available because I did not actually own the, um, or hadn't purchased rather, the weapons expert for the arena workshop. But now I can come in here and I can enter, uh, let's see, the remote minigun I think is one we want to go with, isn't it? Mounted machine guns, that's uh, mounted at the front there, you can see through the grill. Yeah, let's go with the remote minigun I think is the one to go. And of course I've upgraded everything else, we've got the armour plating on full there. Uh, done the usual upgrades, I've done all of this pre-recording. Uh, that's just the what I wanted to show you there, is that we can put the weapons on it still if you own a, an arena workshop, as well as the weapons expert for the workshop. As you can see here now, I've got this mini gun. And it does make light work of vehicles. Look at that. There we go. So that is how you can customise this vehicle once you unlock all of the, uh, or complete all the, all the tier 4 stuff with your um, weapons expert. So come in again. So you need to own five different vehicles, equip body armor, add an attachment to a weapon for tier one, customize your weapon load, add a gun locker, customize a weapon at a weapon workshop, request and collect a Meriwether ammo drop. Have I got the cops? Okay. <laughs> Let's just go back inside for a minute. Where were we? Uh, <laughs> request and collect a Meriwether ammo drop. That's the third and final one there for tier two. For tier three, win a challenge for each weapon type against another player in an ammunition shooting range. Now, I got my friend, Dread Pirate Rob, to come and join me to do that. He just made sure he lost them all for me. And that's what I suggest you do, get a friend to do it. Own one of each weapon type, there are eight of them. Open up here, so handguns, submachine guns, assault rifle, shotguns, light machine guns, heavy. Ah, that's the ammunition. <laughs> Let's come down here, so weapons are the melee pistols, machine guns, assault rifles, shotguns, snipers, heavy and throwables. And you need to visit the gun van every day for 10 days. And then for tier 4, it's a, an extension of the ammunition one, you need to win 10 challenges to do each of the 6 weapons. And then just do a, a further four random ones with your friend. Own all of the Mark II weapons. So that is every every Mark II weapon that's available to be upgraded through a weapons workshop. Own 50 weapons and lock all, unlock all Mark II ammo types. You need to do that through your bunker, I believe, through your research. And then you can claim the Speedo, the Vapid Speedo Custom. And there it is behind me there. 
Anyway, that's going to do it for this video. I hope you found it useful because uh, it took me a little bit of research to find this out. So some of you may not be aware of it like I wasn't. Uh, so if you find it, found it useful, please drop a like. If you want to see more GTA content like this, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.